here what is going on friends so before i continue to share this video this is your boy con forex strategy factory yeah you're gonna do me a favor right now by sharing this video to everybody involved so that your fans you know and many of our people can know that there is a video like this which we made on our channel we we're gonna be talking about bollinger bands and from the angle i'm gonna pick it up is i told you to pay attention to where the bollinger band has escaped the middle band okay now the bollinger band i said we always use is the 20 period bb you know we use this one and you can see on my screen is 20. so this is what we always use and then what do i what have i said about it very important stuff what have i said about it i said that when a bollinger band had escaped the middle band which is done all the way from here okay all right there is every possibility of it rolling back down what do i mean every possibility of rolling back down this is still a flat zone okay this is a flat zone but there's every possibility of it okay this is a flat zone i tell you here the flat zone at the top okay so there's every possibility of that bollinger band to roll back down okay inside a downward moving wedge not drawing it properly right now because um i've not seen the structure which i can draw the wedge but i hope you can see the wedge the bollinger band will move down and then coming back to exactly where it escaped the band the middle band which is here it escaped the middle band around here if you can see it bollinger band escaping the middle band from this zone this is where it is likely to you know to get back to this zone let me make it like like a green so we know if like let's say that is going to be a final tp if it's coming down okay all right now i think we've done the the real best thing but i'm still gonna do one thing because sometimes it even pulled to the point of breaking the lowest you know the lowest point it ever made where the overall movement started you know which is this one so sometimes it does come to maybe either test or break it but i think the way it is now we we, we we have figured out a standard trade and what do you need if you have a trade that looks like this what do you need to follow it for the reversal is about to do you know because i i can see something like a reversal forming up <laughs> and it's going to travel inside this this wedge this and this so what are the things you need to follow this type of you know of market so after you understand about this bollinger band what it does escaping the middle band and then it's going to come back so what you need you need your support resistance that can tell you when to sell you need a buy sell arrow which can tell you when to sell 